The easiest way you can code using your voice here in August 2024 is using uh, an AI copilot in your code editor plus your own computer's built in dictation tool. The copilot can be anything you want. I've gotten the best results out of chat gpt in the code gpt extension for vs code and i have a video on how to set that up but really any ai copilot will work you're just looking for that prompt and the large language model that will get the syntax of your code right and then your computer windows or mac has a dictation tool built in um, that has to be enabled on windows in settings uh, you can search for online voice recognition and enable that or on mac you can enable dictation in system settings but then once you're in the copilot chat focused on the text input box on windows you can hit windows key plus h or on mac function key twice some newer mac models you hit the globe key twice to start talking you talk into the AI Copilot's chat, explain what you want. That AI Copilot will get the syntax right and you import that into your text file. Now, if you think that's too simple to actually be the most efficient way to code by voice, I want to do a quick comparison with the best dedicated voice coding tool that I found, which is Talon. Here's a demo that I saw Josh Camo put out. Let's see what he does using Talon to code by voice. Slap second, go up. Styled button wrapper. Blank rule background color. Color variable primary. Slap. Blank rule font size. Two red each made. Slap. Rule cursor pointer. Rule color white. Okay, now while that did work amazingly well, the problem is that you would have to learn to speak a whole language like slap for end of line and enter and then to spell out rem saying two red each made now i'm going to code up the same styled button element using dictation in here i'm going to use copilot so i'm in vs code in github copilot's chat i click into the chat box hit windows key h and then i just explain what i want can you create a style button component called wrapper with a background color as a CSS variable, a font size of two rem units, and a cursor of pointer, and a color of white? Now I hit enter, and it gives me the exact same code. I was just able to prompt that with a conversational style. It got the syntax exactly the same. So exactness is being handled by the AI Copilot. If you know of any easier way to code by voice, please do let me know.